the apple tree and the farmer. Once upon a time, there lived a farmer in a village, beside a forest. He had a big garden that had an old apple tree and other plants, trees and beautiful flowers. When the farmer was a little boy, he spent much of his time playing with the apple tree. Those days, the apple tree had given the choicest of apples to him. However, as time passed, the apple tree became old and stopped bearing fruits. Now that the farmer was not getting any apples from the tree, he decided that the tree was useless. Therefore, he decided to cut the tree and use its wood to make some new furniture. He felt that since the tree was old and huge, he did not have to cure it, and it would make great furniture. He forgot that as a boy, he had spent his entire childhood climbing the tree and eating its apples. Now the apple tree was home to several little animals in the neighborhood. This included squirrels, sparrows and a huge variety of birds and insects. When the farmer took his axe and began chopping the tree, all the little animals came rushing down. They all began to plead with the farmer. They gathered round the farmer and said, Please don't cut the tree. We used to play with you when you were small, under this very tree. This is our home and we have no other place to go. The farmer was adamant. He raised his axe and the commotion grew. Please don't chop and destroy my home and kids, cried the squirrel. Please don't chop and destroy my nest, cried the little birds. Please don't cut the apple tree, cried the grasshopper. The farmer, however, forgot his childhood and his animal friends. He began to chop the tree harder. All the little animals became desperate, and wanted to protect the apple tree at any cost. The little animals said, We will sing for you when you are toiling away in the fields. We will look after your little boy, will you? He will not cry, but instead will be entertained and happy. You will like our songs and will not feel tired. However, their cries for help fell on deaf ears. 